Uh, all right. Alrighty, 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 First of all, a sip of water. You know, hydration is important. Now, welcome back, everybody, to the channel. This is for Sir One Video. Uh, I mean, live stream. I don't know, the camera's a little bit weird. Now, why is that? Uh, there we go. Just a little bit of an adjustment. Yeah! All right, now it's now it's too high. God damn it! I just want to stream professionally for once, and this is already a very interesting start into our interesting, and it's off again. Huh? This way? Yeah, this works fine. Welcome back, everybody, to another live stream. I hope you guys are doing very, very well. I was looking very much forward to streaming again today for the second time of the day. I don't know why, but I'm so, like, hyped to stream. I don't know. It's just definitely be awesome because I'm trying out these new things. I mean, today we tried to fly. I mean, earlier today, it was in, in the morning of today, I tried to fly uh, a Lockheed, a literal Lockheed Super Connie. It didn't work at all, but I, I tried it, and it was a mistake. It was a big mistake to actually try it. But it's, it's just fun, you know, to also, you know, try some misery. And today, I would like to also. But we've got two debut flights, two first flights today. But the first one of it was, of course, again the Super Connie. The second first flight. Well, everybody, that's gonna be the DHC6 Twin Otter. What's wrong with the flight, Smith? What was that of a graphic? Great. Thank you for showing me that piece of. Car, yes, everybody. The twin otter. We're gonna fly this, and well, we're gonna be at the t the home of its t of the twin otter. Everybody, the Nepalese mountains. Let me just get rid of the snow. I mean, Jesus Christ. I mean, I've turned on life weather, uh, which was a mistake. Yeah, that looks so much better. My goodness, look at those beautiful mountains here now. I mean, you know, like, come on, we've got to respect the money that Bing put into making. You know, uh, the satellite imageries. Look at this. We, we cannot just cover with snow. What's up, Robbie? Close Thank West. you so much, dude. Oh, man. You guys are crazy. What's up, bye, Jacko? You already are donating. We haven't even moved a single Big inch. Jack I'm always saying... donated five Australian so, dollars. Good day, mate. Glad I get to catch a live stream today. Smiley face. Smiley face. Oh, yeah, how's face. it going? Yeah, right now, it is... Uh, how, what's, what's the time right now? My, my, my time zones are broken, isn't it? All right now it is quite early in the morning in uh, in Australia. It's not even that late night, right? Right now it's uh, 12 in Honolulu. It's right now noon in Honolulu, so that's great. 15, so 3, 3 p.m. in LA, for example, on the West Coast. Then we've got London coming in at uh, 10. And then we've got me, who's right now streaming at 11 in the evening. Well, and yes, I think uh, in N Nepal, we're going to have like four or five in the morning. Uh, so that's interesting. Anyway, this is what this beautiful airport looks like. We all know and love Lukla. And my God, it looks just absolutely amazing here in the flight simulator, especially here at the ramp. They have done this very well. Again, this, you know, this is actually hand drawn and this is not even an, an add on. Anyway, it is now finally time to get actually into this airplane. And well, then we've got a pretty wrong liver. Nordland Air. Probably that's from, what's that country? Does it have a, no, okay, it doesn't have a flag on it, but I'm guessing this is somewhere, maybe, uh, ah, there it is, Norway. All right. What's up, man? Anonymous. Anonymous. Donated Welcome two back. Euros. Hello, Swiss. Yeah, we've got a new voice, as you can hear. Anyway, let's go and actually uh, get this plane going. Uh, so we've got the flight control lock. How do I get rid of it? I mean, seriously, how do I get rid of it? Wait, um, flight control. Wait, how do I get rid of it? Of course, I I cannot, you know, otherwise the joystick's not. Oh my God, Mike. Me catch donated five dollars. Sub Swiss in the mic that you always knew. So Mike, welcome back. Glad to hear you. Uh. Wasn't hard to, to miss. No, yeah, what was hard? Was hard to miss. How did I get rid of this control? I mean, Jesus Christ. I just completely died right there. Um, I want to get rid of this control lock so we can refly our plane. How do I do that? Can you... <laughs> wait a second. So wait, here's the... How do I engage with the damn control? I mean, seriously now. I, I don't want to press any switch. It's like that actually, you know what? This is actually a very realistic plane. I think this is from Aeros Aerosoft, right? So this is like proper, proper airplane. And uh, it's a shame that we haven't flown just yet. Actually, you know, you know, all the switches here work, which is almost 
to this point where it's kind of scary, actually, how realistic this plane is. I want to get the control lock right off. Can we open the door? Yes! That's cool to see, actually. You know what? This, this plane is actually pretty good. It's a shame that I haven't actually tried it before. We've got some pilots animated here, which is always a little bit creepy. I don't know if I, if I like that. But anyway, this is looking good. Anyway, can we please... Control lock. I cannot engage with it. And why not? Why can't I get just get rid of it? Come on. Where's the control lock? It's right here. Hmm. Maybe somewhere. Help! Aha! Wait. Okay. Something that doesn't work at at, at least is the um the, the the circuit breakers. So wait. How do I get rid of the damn stuff? Guys, can anyone help me out here? Remove this cover. All right. This is what in the case where we crash, which is probably going to happen anyway. So wait, how do I get this plane to turn off? Wait, how do I get the control lock off? Huh? I mean, seriously. Aha! Oh, it, oh, this is actually kind of cool. All right, everybody, learning with Swiss is one, everybody. The control lock on the Twin Otter. Actually, it's implemented into the ground. Yes. Great. This is the, I know, a very mandatory thing on the Twin Otter planes, I guess. Put the control lock on. I've never personally done it on the Cirrus's, for example, even though there are control locks for that, for those, but, you know, on Cessna's you do it, mostly. Some, sometimes. Most people don't actually do it. I mean, especially if you're just, you know, having it stand around somewhere in the hangar. <sighs> Good! Now it is time to turn on the airplane. Jesus Christ. Good. So how do we do that? Um, I have I've not flown this plane before. So here's the ignition switch. We have to we have to find our our switches first of all. The, the ignition switch we all know and love it. How it's literally located right next to the landing lights. That's great to see. Engine one ignition. This is good. All right, DC master switch. Okay, is this the bat? Oh yeah, here's actually the battery master switch. All right, all you basically need is on this panel. That's great to see. Oh. I already. Oh my God! Please don't. Oh, I'm sorry. No, I didn't want to start the engines already. That, but that's a little bit too soon. Uh, I mean, uh, that, all right, that was the quickest startup I've ever done in my entire life, that plane just literally just went, uh, what, what the hell happened here, I just, what, I didn't even press the ignition switch, oh, I did, I had before, I guess, engine started to the, I just put it to the, I accidentally turned on the airplane very, very soon. I mean, this could have been very dangerous in real life. All right, come on. Can we give it some more, more power? Yes, everybody. Our, our reverse, our, our plane is working. We've turned it on accidentally. I, I didn't even have to turn on fuel. That's very strange. Where's the fuel lines here? All right, this is the, this is the, oh, oh. All right, this is cursed now because I've literally, I had, I have the fuel control turned off. Right, the, the mixture is off, so. The engine shouldn't even be Patrick spinning. I donated two euros. What's up, bro? Uh, Just Patrick. Just love that. Schluckspecht. Interessantes Tier. Anyway, is our plane working? Two pounds. Thirsty the airplane is one. literally... Yeah, what's up? Thirsty. <laughs> yeah, chug of the water bottle. Now, let's go in and engage the prop here to... Uh, because, again, this has an adjustable prop. I wonder now, what is the proper anger, angle? Okay. We need, like, maximum power. Maximum strength and power, everybody. All right, this has been one of the quickest startups I've ever done in my entire life. So that's good to see. Let's go ahead and actually get some flying done now. So I'm gonna uh, engage, engage this parking brake. This uh, went very, very quick. No, actually so quick that I'm kind of worried about the the realism of this airplane, honestly. that I, I, I thought this, I mean, all those switches here work, isn't it? Right. We didn't even get to press this stuff here in the back. And nothing of this. I just turned it on accidentally. Let's get the engine generator on, though. That's important. It's a Butterman! Is it the real Butterman? I almost don't believe it. Is this a real Butterman? The real Butterman would donate $100. But it's actually not the real Butterman. Good. Um, we don't even have to turn on the bleed air, which is interesting. Let's get some of uh, those seat belts on. Whatever. Just press some of those switches to see if they work. Uh, we've got de-icing boots. We might just want to need that here up in the Nepalese mountains. Good. This is actually, this is cool. Propeller de ice. We might just want to need that actually, honestly. Not very smart to put it on on the takeoff, but you know, who cares? 
Anyway, looking good, looking good. General light brightness. All right, this is for the lights, reading light. Oh yeah. And in case you want to read, read some literature, you know, if you're a Swiss or one um, channel viewer, then you are probably aware of the literature. Anyway, it is now time to just take off. What's up, Mike, man? Welcome back. Four months. Yeah, dude. Are you, are you, in, you are in the, I hope you are in the thing, you know. Good, that's in the description now. Let's go into some case of parking brake. Oh my god, that was loud. Hello, Cullen. How's it going, man? OMG. Cullen Thank Bellows you so much. Jesus $19 Christ. And Let's go. Swiss, what is your favorite aircraft? Um, right now, I like this one. This is good. Look at that, look at that taxi. Wait, you can literally, look at this. Have you seen any other plane be able to do this? I mean, literally. By the way, I do want to see, can we get reverse thrust to work? That's something I would find really very important. How do I go? Okay, that's reverse thrust. Okay, reverse thrust actually works. Yes, have you ever seen a play? Yes! Did you just guys just see that absolutely great stunt? Good, let's get onto this runway. My god, I like this plane super much. Maybe this is just absolutely unrealistic how this thing performs. Look at that. Look at that taxiing. Damn, how awesome. This thing flies like a fighter, like a taxi is like a fighter jet. All right, no, oh, wait, you know what? Oh, no, no. What's up, Robbie? Ah, member for six months, man, that's crazy. God damn it. Let's go, take off. Full power. Straight out, let's go. Is this working? Yes. Actually, no, it's not working. Oh my God, our, 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 our right engine has died. How's that happen now? That can't, that's panky, that can't be good. Wait, start the right engine up again. Aha, it's coming back alive. Um, all right. Spontaneous death. We all know and love it. What's up, Josh? Come back. How's it going, man? Josh OO1 donated one pound and 79 pence. He Swiss, I've donated over $30. Does it count? Uh, you know what? Yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Let's go. I mean, you've, you've been a great supporter, so thank you guys so much. Now. All right, after this spontaneous death, our, our engines are both back and, and, and in some strength. Let's go ahead and actually just take off this plane from Lukla here. Uh, which is the part that I'm not worried about at all. I mean, we can just already pull up already, isn't it? Yes. Look at that. <laughs> oh, man, I like this plane quite a lot. Now, this is actually the Tundra variant. Um, so what that means is you can basically fly this plane literally anywhere. Oh, my God, that was loud. Hello, Jay. Welcome back. OMG. Thank you guys so much for, for being so donatable Evening stuff and stuff today. Thank you so much. You guys are absolutely crazy. Ah, okay. Actually, oh, no. If I may, you know what? This would be a shame. Just imagine. All right. No, 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 no. God damn it. I literally was about to say, just imagine I crashed this plane today. And literally in that moment, I crashed the plane today. Thank you very much. This has been a great stream. Good night. What the hell has that been? I completely stalled the plane out into like a spinning notion. Great, great spin. Anyway, look at the, how this plane flies and also how this plane looks, man. This is gorgeous. Oh my god, Cullen! Thank you guys so much. Why are you donating Bungie. so much? Look at Cullen this plane. Cullen donated $19.99. You guys are absolutely missing. I do like the twin crazy, man. My favorite aircraft is the Boeing 737-900. I like the 737s as well, but the, the 900 has got some. That's the longest one, absolutely. Oh, yeah, I can agree with that. That's good. That's Swiss Rocket. What's up, man? Cents. You guys are crazy. Swiss, how are you, brother? Finally here. Angelic face. Ah! Angelic face. Well, I'm not doing very Angelic well. Angelic face. 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 We need calmness back. Now, I want to actually get this plane landed smoothly now and pro properly. It is not that hard to actually stall out this plane. You don't really have a um, stall warning outside in the outside view. So that goes very quickly. Let's go ahead and turn on the replay mode again. And replay now the landing that I just want to do here at Lukla for a second before we continue to the good um, Nepalese other airports that we have here. We've got a lot of airports here today. Good, let's get this going. All right. Yeah, you know we've got. This is no problem. Eh, oh, that's actually been a proper hard landing. There we go. But no worries for the Twin Otter, which literally has the thickest tires that are available for the plane. 
That's again the Ultra Thunder tr Tundra variant that doesn't need a runway at all. You can pretty much put this plane down anywhere. This has been properly a hard landing. I mean, Jesus Christ. I I'll be honest about that. That's actually been properly hard. I mean, you know, even though on the landing rate meter, we we're technically, we were going literally up. Because this runway is so sloped, we were literally going up with the altitude. So, you know, that was, uh, on, on paper, it was a smooth landing. <laughs> great, that was literally an, uh, uh, an, um, okay, great. Good one. Let's maybe go ahead and uh, just, you know what? I have a good idea. How about we just, you know what? <laughs> I was going to take off with a reverse thrust by reversing down the runway and just seeing what happens when we run off that cliff. But that's another, that's not what we're going to do now. What is, what, okay, wait, 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 what is this do? Do you guys just see that stick on the runway, literally? What is, that is not safe. Anyway, what's up, Johnny Sins? Thank you guys so much. You guys are crazy. What's up, Slime Ore? Or what, what is that? What are those usernames? Now, it is now time for professionalism. Let's take off again. Very nice. And we already have got... Oh my god, that was a lag. Did you guys, did you guys see that lag? That was not a good lag. You know, whenever I'm streaming in the evening, in, in Europe evening at least, I always have these lags sometimes. That's always very strange, isn't it? Anyway, it's, it's back now. That was weird. Anyway, this is good. This is fine. And it's now time to come in for the next airport. And actually, there is one pretty significant one um, in the end of the valley. Let me just actually let's use the Xbox joystick again because actually the, the, the slew mode on that one is absolutely magnificent. What's up, man? The green family. Come on. Oh, I, I plugged off the, the Xbox. Here we go, this is the Xbox controller. The holy Xbox controller. Ah, shut up. There we go. I can just use the slew mode on here. Look at that, look at that, how, how, how smooth that is. We can go up, we can get down and everything. And yes, everybody, this is now the runway. I don't know what it's called, this airport. But it's got a little, it's, this is a very, very small airstrip. It's not even an airport. Yes, everybody. Um, for the first time ever in a long time, we are actually flying now to unpaved runways as well. What's up, Johnny Sins? What's that, what's that, Johnny Sins? Thank you, Johnny. Anyway, where's the damn, where's the damn airport even? You know, you, you know we've reached a point where you're, when your airport, ah, there it is. Okay, this is the runway. It's not very, it's not very big of an airport, is it? Anyway, no problem for the Tundra variant here of the DHC6 Twin Otter. Actually, even the normal variant will find its way just fine here. Let's get the flaps going, even though... Oh, my flaps lever is broken, isn't it? Huh. Did I break my flaps? Oh, I did. I might have actually done that. Guys, my... No. All right, what do we do now? Are we supposed to restart the flight simulator? I guess we are. I don't know what to do. I don't want to rage all the time. Uh, what's up, Johnny? Since can you be my dad? Um, not now. All right, this has not gone well at all. The flight simulator just completely died. What happened there? I did nothing to, to break this. Uh, all right, let's restart the flight simulator, I guess, and just maybe see some. Can we get some t some twin otter, twin otter hard landing, something like that, some twin otter content that relates to it. You know, I just wanna, I, I just wanna fly the twin otter, and then the plane just dies. Oh great! I, you know, this is a great start of the day when you when you, when you search a twin otter hard, and then you the Swiss is there one video comes up from two years ago. What is this right here? This is the weird Swisses are one channel, February 14. You know what's crazy about this video is that it's, it literally was, I, I, I uploaded this before COVID happened. Isn't that a crazy thought? This literally happened before COVID. COVID was not a thing here. Ukraine was not a thing here. On the war. 
operating in harsh conditions is a rugged landing gear, which is given here. We have a pretty rugged landing gear, which is why this plane. Hello, Swissers are one. Why am I? Why was I speaking so weirdly? Good. We've got some more. We've got a scary landing. What else we've got? Oh yeah. We also we've got right here. Yeah, those are those are the ones that I'm expecting. Why is everything why is everything so laggy here? My computer is genuinely broken. Uh oh. Well, it's gonna be a lot of alerts because I've pressed on the Microsoft a lot of times now. That's that's gonna have a lot of your game is already running. The game is already running. The game is already running. Oh my god, it's literally I, th I think it's breaking my computer actually, in fact. This is miserable. Oh, come on. Uh alright. Let's watch some video here. Good, so Everybody, let's rate this landing right here. We've got a scary landing twin auto devilant Suavano House airstrip. Let's just ignore the alerts in the background. Yeah, look at this one. Good, letting coming up. We probably shouldn't really be standing on the runway, should we? I was thinking we might be allowed to do this in many There we go. I mean, that's been a good landing. Scary land. What's that been? That's not been scary. He's coming right for us. Are we slipping around a bit? That's not been scary. Oh, yeah, okay, never mind. Actually, oh. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, damn. Fuck. Is that normal? Oh, to be skidding around like that. That is some wet ass. Oh! That's some wet grass. Right there. That is the wettest grass I've ever seen. Oh, my God. Jesus uh, Christ. I mean, uh, luckily, that damn pro pro propeller is very high above ground. All right, what do we got right here? Twin Otter airplane braking on that. You know what? This actually, this clip looks almost fake. Oh my God, Cullen! Thank you so Thank much, you. man. You're crazy. Cullen Bellows donated $19.99. I can Cullen. smell the fumes coming from your PC yeah. right here. <laughs> That's the vibes right now. Let's maybe see this landing right here. Let's see if it's also going to... Check this out. We've got a harsh cross from landing here for sure. Very, very high 4K clip for sure as well. I cannot even see. I cannot, like, literally, I can count the pixel on this video. Thank you. Come on. Okay, we uh, apparently this is not a, even a hard landing, but a very, very quick stop. Which is definitely the case here, too. This is crazy, man. The destiny, man. Why does the voice not speak for me? You have to donate at least two dollars. Two, like two, two zero. So this is why. <laughs> All right, let's check this one out. Wittero, Otter, oh my God. Isn't this Wittero airport the one that was closed because of literally a twin otter plane crashed there because of the harsh winds? Oh my God. Jesus Christ. And that was a butter landing. Guys, look at that approach. Look at that. Look at those winds. That's been a butter landing. I, I, seriously, that's been a butter landing right here. Look at that. My God. Ah, uh, uh, so can we get some hard landings though? Like, look at the, look at by the way how big these planes are. After all, these are not small Cessnas, right? These are actually kind of. <laughs> Look at all these alerts. I like how the flight simulator still shows black screen. Thank you very much. Anyway, we've got this one right here. Hmm. Oh, there's me. That's interesting. There's cats. Otter and cat stay at home was interesting. I literally posed a twin otter hard. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Let's, let's check this one out. What is this one here? Engine failure on takeoff? Why is this plane, why is this livery so incredibly ugly? What's up, Pojama po Dairy? You guys are so crazy on the donations. I don't even know why we're watching Twin Otter videos because of lights in our crash. All right, let's check this. This is an incredibly ugly livery. I just want to mention that here again. What's up, Joey? Thank you so much, man. Okay, that's been a takeoff. Looking good, actually. What's wrong here? We've got two million views here on the clock. All right, let's check this out. Oh, look at that. I hear that sound, man. That's beautiful. What's wrong? Oh, oh, yeah, Jesus Christ. It's actually, there's an engine failure. But what do you do as a pilot here in this case? Um, as both, as not both engines are, are both engines fail? Okay, it's only the right one. I would continue the approach and just come in for a pattern. Uh, I would not, like, set for an emergency. I would, I would, or maybe teardrop approach. That's just, this is interesting, man. 
I'm Colin Colin again. You guys are doing crazy. You know what? I'm going to give you a mod today. How about that? I saw your videos on Airfly 2022 and I plan on getting it. Dude, Airfly 20. What is this guy doing here? The parachuter. Great. Um, yeah. I mean, I definitely can recommend it, dude. It's awesome. All right, let's see. It doesn't crash as much. Oh, yeah. Look at that. The flight simulator is back. What a dream. And we've got this flight simulator music, which is now kind of new, isn't it? And I hate it. Do I hate it? I don't know. It's, it's kind of, it's kind of, it's very quiet, but it's kind of all right. I'll say that. It's fine. Yeah. You know what? I've, this is not too bad. Let's maybe go ahead and uh, come in for the next airport. I mean, there, there's a thousand, there are thousands of airports here. I mean, which one should we go for? I mean, we've got Paflu. We guys remember Paflu, right? Just spawn back in to Nepal. Pretend like the flight simulator didn't just completely die and crash and die and everything a second ago. It's the old X-Plane music. That's cool. Uh, FSX music, I mean. Jesus Christ. How did I not recognize this? Of course, the, the orchestral music. Um, let's just ignore this. You guys have not seen this. This is a spoiler for a new video. Good. Now, anyway, it's now time to fly. Yes, yeah, our beautiful airplane. We've got some beautiful sounds here. Let's get rid of the snow, though, again. I hate the snow here in the flight simulator because, again, it just covers the beautiful satellite scenery of the Bing. Good. Now, it is now time to come in for a bit of a landing right here. Put the music back on, at least. Dun, 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 dun. And the Pablo Airport is coming up down here. This is a pretty nice long runway, which means we can finally have the chance to butter this airplane. We still have no access to the flaps, which I'm kind of worried about. Uh, I guess my 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 Thrustmaster thing might be broken, right? If I engage my flaps here, it won't actually do anything. And it's properly broken as well, so... That can't be good. You know what? That can't, really can't be good. Anyway, it's coming for a landing. The throttle still works. That's the start. Good. Now, this is so beautiful down here. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this land. Look at this lighting here. Menu community friend Dog request received, man. Donated three dollars and ninety-three cents. Here we go. Hey Swiss, are you looking forward to the PMDG seven hundred thirty-seven? Oh, I'm not looking forward to it at all. <laughs> yeah, no, of course not. We are all. We all are. You know, what are those questions? It's like, it's like, it's like asking me, yeah, what do you, Swiss, what do you think about war? Like, isn't that kind of an obvious answer? Of course, we are all looking forward to that airplane. Let's stop the airplane. Oh my God, go around. Okay. All right, Swiss is there one. I have one question for you, Swiss is there one. How did I? How did it just crash a twin otter? Literally, I just managed to overrun a twin otter. I don't know why, but we were coming in very ridiculously fast. At least we didn't stall, but too fast. Crashed into a house. Wouldn't have survived it. I would have gone around in real life, so that does not, it's not a factor, but you know. All right, let's come in for, again for a landing. My God, why is this so fast? Come on, we need less speed. Maybe put the flaps back up though. Come on, I, I literally have the, we are using reverse thrust, isn't it? Why are we so extremely fast? This is ridiculous. This is as fast as like a 737. <laughs> oh my God. All right, now, let me try to stop here now. Uh, all right. Maybe a successful landing. My God, what has that been? I like how the stream just started off so well until the flight summit of 2020 crashed and then uh, we just, it just lost it all. Anyway, let's check out this landing here in the replay mode. Very interesting of a landing right here indeed. A bit smooth, I'll be honest. <laughs> yeah, just plain. All right, I, I want to actually get this plane landed smoothly, but this is the way too long of a runway for, you know, somewhat of an exciting landing. So let's maybe to just take off again here. Yes, look at that. All right, we might be stalling out a little bit. Why is the power so low here? Um, what's wrong with the rotate uh, with the with the RPM with the with a prop one, prop thing, prop, you know. Prop is all good. Propeller is all good. All right, let's, let's set to the max. All right. I don't really have enough power here. We need more strength. Good stream so far, though. Now, I would like... Shh. Shush. I would like to find another airport where we can do a proper runway testing. Proper Swisses are one testing, for sure. Right, we've got this one right here. This is apparently a grass area. 
uh, Victor November Kilo Lima here. Very small grass strip. You know, this is just to connect all these villages um, together here in Nepal. And actually, they're actually they're 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 pretty necessary to connect them all together. So this is kind of cool to have. Uh, oh, the camera just died. Wait a second. It's back now. Guess what? It's back. Yes. Now, um, where's the strip? I want to find it. This is hopeless. This is a very good stream, by the way. Go oh, is it on top of him? Oh my god, is it here? Oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's not even a... Oh my god. Look at that strip. And it's just absolutely beautiful of an approach for sure. Let's get rid of the speed right here. And try to really land here properly. I mean, Jesus Christ. What is this? What's well, an airstrip? My goodness. Who built a... Who was, you know, funny enough to build a little va uh, village here on top of a mountain? I mean, this is probably the only place where you could build an airport. Okay, you know what? There's a lot of space here in the valley. Never mind. All right, very safe airport coming in for a landing. Let's get some reverse thrust in here to get this plane properly now landed down here. Get the flight control replay mode on. I like how this plane literally, you can literally do anything with it. It doesn't really care. A little <laughs> reverse thrust in mid-flight. There we go. That. That's been, that's been kind of, that's been so all right. Look at that, look at that stop. This was literally a VTOL landing. This was a VTOL. And this is ridiculous. This is best, be got better VTOL capabilities than the F-35. We might, we might, we might have bounced a little bit. But that's just very normal um, when you approach like this. And actually, you know what? This landing has been smooth. <laughs> that's like the most ridiculous part. Like, I don't know why, but every landing here looks kind of, like a, kind of like a butter machine, I think. You know what? This is honestly almost like a butter machine. Like every landing looks like like, every landing looks like it's alright to the airplane, you know what I mean? Like, even hard landing doesn't look like it's bad. And I mean, look at that stop. I think, can you guys forgive me that hard landing, especially considering this absolutely ridiculously fast stop? We didn't overrun again, so that's gone well. My god, I want to see this landing again. This is absolutely majestic. Look at that. Boom. Okay, that, you know that bounce? We could, we could work on that. Even though even that, that bounce doesn't even look that bad. My God, what an aeroplane, isn't it? All right, now, let's go ahead and turn off, uh, well, turn to the left and just take off again. How about that? Oh God, <laughs> wait, no way. <laughs> Look at this plane, man. This is absolutely crazy. This literally, this, this flies like an RC plane in a, like a very good way. This is awesome. Let's go ahead and take off again. Let's have Concord Mapper. There we go. Look at, we can already pull the nose up. <laughs> Now, it's very quick to tail strike this plane. Very quick. But that's another story. Let's take off here. Oh, you know what? The tail... That is not going well. Or is it? All right, we're stalling out. You, you really do not want to stall out the airplane. Let's get... Yep. Yeah, there we go. That's gone well. Let's go ahead now. And do well. Come in for the next landing. Next airport. And we've got a lot of them here in Nepal. A lot of... Especially grass runways. We might just want to try these out. This is, ah, yeah, this is really good now. All right, so what's the next one? Victor November Romeo Tango, and look at this one. My God, so many undiscovered ones. And this is really interesting. All of these are, I didn't, I didn't expect all of these airports to be absolutely crazy here in very, very close proximity to Lukla, but all right, I'll take it. Let's check this one out. Can we do a smooth landing? I like this. Yeah, you know what? This plane actually works so well that it's almost boring. All right, let's put the uh, put everything let's get everything ready here. Let's get rid of some speed by pulling that reverse thrust, which is no problem at all. Yes. Look at this. Now we've got some trees in front of us that we might just want to avoid. By the way, I like how the simulator's just still saying menu community friends request received. Let's go to that landing on now. now. All right. You know, that's not been asked. Like, you don't even have to try to land this plane smoothly, you know, because it doesn't really matter in the end after any, any, any you know what I mean? It doesn't matter anyway, you know, in the end. So this has been fine. Absolutely smooth plateau landing or whatever it has this, but this is good. 
Check this out here. Look at this! This has been absolutely buttery! We'll see By the way, I like, I like the new um, particle, particle animation here in the flight simulator. This has been absolutely all right. We'll see this again. This is good. This is absolutely crazy of an airplane. I just want to mention that again. I mean, I've mentioned this like a thousand times now. Let's take off again. Full power. Yes, look at that. Look at that here. Good. Yes! <laughs> this is ridiculous of a plan. I like this. Now, what could be next airport? This, these are all absolutely weird and interesting and stuff. Uh, now, can we have some... Hmm. Let's maybe check this one out. We've got Victor November Juliet India. This one is a little bit further away. This could be interesting to, you know, just see. Or is there anyone near by? No, never mind. Everything's fine. Juliet India it is. Let's go. Yeah, see, look at that speed, lightning speed. And let's check out our lightning airport. Where is it now? Oh my god. Is it now in the... Is it this one in the valley? Is there one in the... Is this one in the... Oh my god, it's in the valley. All right. For the first time, someone has listened to my complaints, not build an airport on a little mountain. That's a start. I mean, now this is a little bit bad because they've built it now in the shade of the sun. So... That honestly, that almost quite sucks, but let's come on for a landing anyway. Let's do this. Look at this. Amazing. Is this even the runway? You know, we've reached the point where you really cannot even tell whether something is runway or not. The Twin Otter! There we go! That's gone very well. I might have stole out the plane and I didn't hear the stall alert or I didn't, I didn't, I didn't see the... I did it intentionally or something. Where's the next airport? Come on. We find some more airports. All right. Maybe some more deeper here in the mountains. My God. This is like the problem now. Since the flight simulator 2020 crashed, literally a second after taking off properly. Right. I don't even. There's no route here. I had a perfect route, man. Everything was fine. Everything was set up. I don't even know any more airports here. We can land on literal mountains, which is kind of, you know, what the airports are like here. So that's interesting. Huh. You know what? So if we actually go to Kathmandu Airport, the international airport, or the, you know, the capital city of this beautiful country, I don't know what we're doing. Because I'm literally out of options here. And it's like crazy. Look, look at this huge capital city right here. Very close actually to Mount Everest. This is like maybe like a 30 minute flight to Los Angeles. Uh, Los Angeles? Oh, damn, that would be sick. No, the California mountains aren't that tall. But uh, let's come in for a bit of a landing right here. Uh, so look at that beautiful runway coming in. Let's go ahead and do a landing here. Yeah, I want to. You know what? Let's maybe not land on the runway. That's, you know what the plane was made for. Do we have a bit of a longer building here? Do we have a bit of a longer building? Let's land on the building. Everybody change a plan. It's time to land on a building. We've got a few buildings that could... That don't... That won't work. Oh, you know what? Maybe let's start with an airport building. You know, because airport hangars are always big. We've got this... It's not very landable friendly, is it? Yeah, let's try it anyway. I mean, this is a twin otter. It doesn't really matter. Let's keep it some good speed. Oh my god, it's good speeds. God damn it. Good, come on. Get yourself that in now, plane. Get everything ready. Let's do this. Yes. 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 No! God damn it. You know, that's like the biggest air, uh, thing here nearby. So I need to I need to get this plane landed on that. Maybe we could use actually, you know what? We could use this side of the, like, you know, land, this, land on this side here. Maybe that's a good idea. Get this. Oh my God, we're way too slow. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, now let's pull out the replay mode. Um, Great. Do we have Flywings 2021? What? 
No, I just read this in the in the chat. Wait, is there a new fly wings? Don't tell me. Huh? What are we looking at? There's a new fly wings? I just saw this in the chat. This is really important now. Fly wings flight simulator. What the hell? This is app advice. Plane simulator lets you explore. All right, I need to, I need to get back onto the flying. I'm sorry, that, that really caught me off guard now. All right, now it's time to come in for a, a nice landing here, hopefully. Get the flaps fully down. That's very important. And now let's maybe try not to die. This is not a very even roof here, as you can see, obviously. So let's maybe try to do this. All right. All right. All right. Oh. Well, plane might have fallen apart into the into the built the buildings in the flight simulator. Isn't they're kind of weird, isn't it? This has gone well. No, that, no, or not. I mean, you know what? Maybe we should find another roof that will properly work. We've got this one right here. Um, this will definitely not properly work. You know what? This probably wasn't the best idea, was it? To land on a roof instead of a runway. Because, I mean, the runway is way too la uh, large, but the roofs are way too small. I mean, which which roof is even able, in like, anywhere in the world to, to hold a proper twin otter? I mean, hmm. What is this right here? Interesting. Hmm. This is very hopeless. Yeah, the, la the buildings here are not long enough. I mean, why would you need buildings long enough to land planes on them? Hmm. All right. Let me try to do a landing here. Let's try to actually butter this now. Yes. Oh, you know what? Let's maybe try to... Wait, we're very fast. Anyway, let's maybe do this anyway. Good one. And this is a very, very good stream. I don't know. I just wanted to fly this airplane just for for once. Then the problem about this one is really the, the the crash ruined the whole stream because my whole flight route was ruined then. Right? That was not a butter landing. Anyway, again, the plane doesn't care. This is not a plane you butter, is it? So yeah, guys. I mean, you know, that was definitely a ruined stream from the crash. Thank you, Mr. Flight Simulator, for intentionally crashing my sim. And uh, thank you guys for watching this, of course. Thank you guys so much for all the donations. I mean, why? Again, you guys are crazy. Thank you guys so much. Um, you guys are absolutely... You guys are ridiculous. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. As always, uh, good night, you guys. This has gone well. I like this airplane. We should probably fly this in the Caribbean, though. You know. <laughs>